All right, ladies and gentlemen, I, I, I hate to stop. Uh, I hate to interrupt a very interesting uh, this early morning discussion on God and soul. And I'm sure that you have, uh, you know, deliberated on the uh, questions as fundamental as is there a God? What is God? And which God? And uh, of course, after this, we're going to look at the, the nature of the soul itself. And what is the origin of the soul, what is the fate of the soul, and also, finally, the destiny of the soul. So, I hope you can get the discussion done uh, with some kind of uh, you know, understanding of all this concept in, of, in, in, 40, in uh, the remaining 40 minutes. But, <clears throat> I'd like to hear from your, um, from your group, the representative of your group, what did you uh, discover from the first question? What, is there a God? So, there's an Interesting early morning question. Want to start? Yes. Yes. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. So, yes, there is a God. But. Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so your answer is yes, there is a God, but. What do yes. you mean? But. Mm, I'm trying to put this in my head right now. Hold on. Mm. Okay, there is a God, but. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there, there, is, there is, there is, a, okay, in my, in my belief, um, I was raised a Christian, so I do believe that there is a higher power, um, there is a God, you can call it whatever you want, anything you want, but that God that you believe in has certain rules and regulations that you're supposed to follow, um, but there are many beliefs out there. Um, so I'm guessing in different people's eyes, in people's eyes there are many different um, rules and regulations that they need to follow that they think is morally and ethically correct. Okay. Right. So I believe there is a God, but people name it when there shouldn't be a name for it. Okay. People see it as themselves when they shouldn't because they can't perform magic. Okay. Um, so there should be, I mean, I mean, there is a name for God, it can be there anything. Is, we, we, as humans, as for our language, in different languages, we have one saying for that thing, wherever it is, and it's God. Um, we all know that there is a God out there, we all know this. So it's just like, it's, it's, it's just like a thing. <laughs> You're saying that it's just like a thing, it's just like a concept, we know it's, that this it's, exists. It's I wouldn't say it's it's comfortability. I, I wouldn't say that. Like it's I don't I don't know, but there is no one knows. There is just something out there. But because you come from a different region across the world that he created, you know, you saw different things, you were brought in different things that he created. Okay. I'm not gonna follow you because I wanna do something else because he created something else for me to follow. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Why is it that I was just telling her? Why is it that I I believe that I should kill you because I want to take over your land that God put me in to walk on? But why 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 do I have to kill you because you don't believe in my belief when we both know that there's something out there? But you put your rules to it, and I put my rules out there because you. There's something to my girlfriend a hundred years ago. This and I was like, you know what, someone put my rules on it. Okay. Do you, yes. know, do you understand what yes, I'm yes, saying? Yes, yes, right? We all agree with one thing. There is something out there. We all agree with it. But we put rules and regulations on it. Okay. We put our own beliefs in it. And that's what separates us because that's bull. That's BS. If we all know that, that there's one thing out there, right. why can't we all just come together and just be peaceful? And just know, just understand that there's something we're trying, we're trying to res We'll try to resolve this in the six weeks. And whether one, is, <laughs> one, whether one God exists, and number two, what's out there, up there, or no down there, yes. no, one no one knows. So we are, we, are, we are, you know, condemned to find out what is it, you know, before we die, right? Right, good. So please don't use that word, resolve. Resolve? Well, we have yeah. to resolve everything no, before we, we die. We right? cannot, in six weeks, no, we can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next. Yeah, group, yeah. It's not going to be on top of he said, but uh, uh, I believe, like, it's like, I'm not going to say yes or no because I'm not going to get like, in any argument or anything, but 
I'm just going to say maybe because like it's more along, to me it's more along the lines of like what people want to, want to think and like if you find like let's say you find like a hundred thousand dollars on the ground you can either be a oh god just bust me with a hundred thousand dollars or b wow someone's really stupid and want that money on the floor for me and it's like what what do you want to choose like to me it's like more like psychological I guess you can say because like oh this church says you know we should do this and that we need to follow this more and like it's more to me it's more like like I said like whatever you want to choose like if people want to believe it then yeah and if people want to see miracles they'll see it but if people like just like if you're an atheist and you just cancel out everything it's just like oh well like it's just you're just not going to you know what I mean Great. Okay. Right. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. I mean, I don't think that she and I necessarily see things the same way in our group, but um, I think she said she definitely believes in a God, and, and I'm probably going to be the only one in this class to say I don't believe in a God. Um, but and I think it's not true what you said. I feel blessed every day in my life to have the people in my life that I have in my life, to have the family I have in my life. Um, and, and so, yeah, I feel blessed in many ways in my life, um, and that doesn't mean I necessarily have to have religion in my life. But, um, and you know, I agree with a lot of different things um, in this class. But um, you know, okay. people need to get along across the world. There needs to be more peace, and that doesn't necessarily have to do with That's other things. <laughs> okay. Good. <coughs> So you're saying that there's something out there we don't know, and it's so frustrating that we don't know, right? We don't know, and we want to know, but we don't know. There's something there that there's miracle, that you choose your miracle, just like in, you can even believe in the power of the octopus that predicted the, uh, <laughs> the, 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 the yeah, soccer. And uh, in some religion, maybe that's God, reincarnation of uh, the octopus God. But, yeah. yeah. And also what he says, I think it's true too, like, it's kind of ridiculous that you call like a priest or someone father. Like, okay. They're not my father, like, you know, God or anything like that. Like, they're just another man, like, just claiming they preach the word of God when in reality they're just no different than, like, here anybody else. So you object to priests being called father, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, Definitely. good. All right? Yep. Uh, it's, uh, like Frank Zappa, a mother's of invention. <laughs> All right, and, and, and there's also the idea that you don't believe in anything, don't believe in God, and we can still live an ethical life, right? Yeah. So all these things, the three, three of this perspective, fundamentally the, uh, the, the idea that uh, we want to bring um, in this discussion. Uh, before that, let's just move on to, if those of you who believe in the existence of God, then what is God? Let's uh, listen to <coughs> the other groups. Yeah. According to my, uh, the, uh, my um, religious thoughts, God is a uh, um, spirit. God is a spirit. Spirit. Okay. So human beings cannot see sin, but we can sense it. We can okay. probably, um, in a way, we can understand because uh, 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 God can manifest Himself in many ways. All right. Good. Isn't that a very, you know, a very profound answer? God is a spirit and it's unseen and you can feel it, but, and it also, but also it manifests. Uh, again, back to the whole idea that yes and but, right? Yes is spirit, but it can manifest in many forms. But again, the question is that how do we, what kind of manifestations does it take then, right? And God manifests in living things, non-living things. And God manifests again, like my favorite desk over there, is that something there? Uh, spirit manifesting in that. Right. What else? Uh, anyone? What is God? Yeah. He is the spirit that I think, I believe that he created everything. He gave, he gave us our bodies and why we're like this. The ground and the bottom, why the stars and the sky. All of those things and why, like, he started it all, but he gave every single one of us a brain, and that's, that's how, like, everything else came. That's what I think. Very interesting. My question 